Good evening everyone. It is Friday, October 9th. This is my video update to give everyone. Um, this was not a Zoom meeting. I, I did see that. It was a video update. Um, I had the option to either write out everything that I had planned to tell you, but I didn't want the words to get lost in translation. So I'm providing a video first and then I'll provide wording later. Um, I have a lot to tell you all, so I'm going to go on and begin. I have notes because I want to make sure that I don't miss anything. First thing first, we were able to begin beta testing this week. Very excited about that. Um, I've been able to have a first-hand look to see the in-app developers do the testing first. It's called alpha testing, where the app developers first make sure that everything is flowing right and correctly, that when you press this, it does this, that the logic is being taught to the computer. Um, they've been doing that all week. And today, they actually allowed a little bit of user testing just to make sure things is looking right and for us to fix everything that they've already done to make sure that the profiles are being set up correctly. You can see everything on the back inside and that everything is talking to each other. Um, next week, we officially begin more of not only the beta testing but the onboarding of the existing users this beta testing is being done in rounds right now it is utilizing virtual money we have not selected all of the beta testers because you don't know the requirements yet so at this time i can let you know what the requirements are to be a beta tester no need if you have already mentioned that you would like to be a beta tester you don't have to come back to us and say hey i still want to be a beta tester we already have that information i just want to make sure that everyone has clear what the requirements are to be a beta tester so first of all to be a beta tester that means you are testing out the app just to see if the functionality and everything that we want the app to accomplish is working. That first will start off with virtual money. This is not real money at the, um, at the beginning where you're first just trying to see the overall profile effect, the dashboard and everything is working correctly. And then it moves into real money. The real money piece is not Dr. Trees. It is app trees. This app is built for the sustainable app spots. It's not built for the doctor trees. So this will have nothing to do with the doctor trees, the beta testing. This is all about the app trees and making sure that th those work since that is what we're going to be doing from here till forever. So the app spots are what we are testing to make sure that their functionality and they're working. So if you are comfortable utilizing real money in order to be a part of the beta testing, then that is the biggest requirement. So when you receive a random email, again, this is not um, gonna be out for every single person. There is gonna be a randomly selected few who are gonna be chosen to be a part of the beta testing. Just remember, this is a part of this real money. So if you do not wanna do that at that time, just let us know, hey, it's okay, I decline. Or if you want to be a part of the beta test and when we reach out to you, just let us know. Okay, I'm ready to go. What's my next steps? And that is how that is going to be handled. Everything from this point forward is about to flow organically into the app launching. As long as the testing goes well through all the rounds, the in-house developers, the small test of users, and then the larger amount of users up into our overall body, then our app will launch. So we are hoping right now everything is doing well. Um, we, we figured out some little things that we needed to fix, but they were so small that there's no worries. Next week is the big one. That's the one that I can't wait to see how that works because that's all about the payment integration and making sure that everything is doing what it needs to do to make sure that money is flowing properly to every single person as they move through the positions. Um, I'll have another update next week on that just to make sure that everyone is um, aware of what's going on and then also when it comes to the onboarding of the existing users that is also going to be taking place at the end of the week um, there is a verification process in this we are utilizing a major payment processor to make sure that this is all being done and I can now tell you all it is through stripe Stripe has the world's most powerful and easy to use APIs when it comes to technology and payment processing for different companies. They're actually utilized by companies such as Amazon, Google, 
Instacart, Lyft, and even Zoom. Their software is going to take it to another level and when it comes to security and making sure that we are onboarding and verifying our users through the most advanced platform there is to date. Not only does Stripe accept payments, whether it's through online and mobile payments, subscription and billing and point of sale payments, but it's also utilized around the world in several currencies. So what that means for us is whether we have members that are in the UK, Europe, Jamaica, you name it, they will help to make sure that that currency is changing and going and flowing without any issues, which is huge. So their onboarding, their process where all our stuff, our payment information is gonna be stored on their secure platform. I will not have any access to the most sensitive information that is important to you. It is gonna be housed securely on a place that even Amazon trusts. So I'm very happy Happy to be able to share that they have integrated with us. I, I look forward to the partnership that we're about to have when it comes to Wealthshare and I hope you all enjoy the experience that they bring to us because they will definitely be another level of experience when we get into this app. Another thing that I wanted to talk to you on uh, was about that fourth option and that is uh, switching the grandfather trees to app spots um, and that's whether you have grandfather trees, the right amount of grandfather trees, or you have extra grandfather trees on top of your trees that you're not supposed to have. So I'm gonna bring my notes up so I can read this to you so I don't miss anything. So as everyone knows, the ask spots is 1,500 for 4,000. And for some of us, even though we know we have the option where we can either come out of pocket for our own 1,500 or we can put in 500 and then use the wealth share loan, or we can wait for our grandfather tree and then start jumping on the ad spots. Well, there is a fourth option. With the grandfather trees, as you know, it's once a month that those will be taken care of. If you would prefer not to wait for those once a month grandfather trees, there is a way for us to convert those trees to ad spots. Each of your grandfather trees is basically worth $500. So if you have three grandfather trees, that's $1,500. So if you would like to convert it, three grandfather trees over to AppSpots, that means you'll be able to get into the app without waiting three months and be able to take that into your AppSpot and be able to just go on and jump onto your biweekly process. No extra money asked. Or if you're someone who, let's say, you have eight trees. You accidentally took over because somebody ended up losing their trees, something happened or blah, 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 whatever the reason it is. If you have three extra trees on top of your five, then it's automatically going to help you to where you will make sure that those extra trees are converted into an app spot. Now, let's say you have less than three. If you have just one extra tree, that means you have 500 of the 1500. That means you only need to invest 1000 more. Uh, or if you have two, extra spots. That means you have $1,000 worth. That means you only need to invest one more to give you a full app spot. Let's say you have five extra spots. That is $2,500. That means you have one spot that is fully completed and then complete another spot. You just need one more 500 because you had 1,000 left over. So that is some of the options that has been worked out to help those either with extra trees or for those who want to convert their existing trees um, into app spots. I'll make sure to post that information so that you can read it. I just wanted to verbally say it so you can understand that this is only for those who want a fourth option to transfer or convert their grandfather trees. Grandfather is the same as doctored. Um, transfer those to app spots instead of waiting those months for your, uh, your doctor trees. The next thing that I wanted to speak on was when is the list going out to show when the grandfather trees are being taken care of? So within this ne next upcoming week, this is all the testing phase along with onboarding. While we're in the middle of this testing and onboarding phase and getting everyone into the app, the grandfather trees are not being taken care of just yet. However, with the app launching as soon as the testing is over, as soon as it's fully integrated and everything is working, there's going to be a list that's going to be put out this upcoming Monday or Tuesday that's going to show everyone each week 
for the next five weeks who's going to be taken care of within each of those weeks um you're going to see a thousand names on each one and that is just in random order it's just going to make it easy for you to say okay if i'm in week um here's my name and email i'm in week one here's my name and, and email in week two that just lets you know when your grandfather tree dr tree is going to be taken care of so you can kind of plan for that and make your decision on what you would like to do whether that's taking the first second third and now our fourth option another update is the bank letter the attorney is going to be providing that as well that is going to be emailed securely to everyone it's basically your membership partnership agreement um but it's something that you can utilize for your banks you'll be able to show this to your banks to let them know exactly what you're a part of um legally all the legal terms so that they'll know okay this is the type of money that is coming into your account um again for those who still had questions about whether this is income this is not income which if it was that means you were an employee of my company and then you would have a 1099 which could affect your disability instead we, this is classified as loans loans that we are all going to have access to because we're supplying our initial contributions to get access to higher amounts of loans and we're going to continue to contribute to receive to repay all of that in order to keep on having access to these loans as we continue to go through the wealth share commitment so I know that was a lot of information. Um, that's exactly why I decided to do a video update instead of just texting that all out. Uh, I appreciate those who have already submitted some testimonials. Um, I'll repost that as well. If you would like to be featured on the app when we launch and you would like to tell how your time has been through the manual process of Wellshare, you can definitely still fill that out. Definitely continue to follow our IG and Facebook page. Uh, there's a great great material on there a huge shout out to all around arts who has been doing an amazing amazing job with all the different ads that we have and keandra ward for her amazing consistent pr material that she consistently puts out and to all of you who continue to share the page our waiting list is growing quite lengthy uh, in just the week we are almost at 1500 people on the waiting list please get your loved ones on that waiting list because at this point it's going to probably take a little time to get all of those new members into the app because we're the first ones getting in um, but for new people they really need to get on that wait list as soon as possible so that that way they can at least get in within the first month of the app launching i hope everyone have a great friday thank you so much i'm so excited we finally made it and um, I will be sure to update you all next week. Thank you.